All right, down. Script. So, yeah. oh, wait. It all started back on May 6, 1864 in Chattanooga. With 100,000 soldiers, the Union General Sherman began his march to the sea, waging total war on the South. Men, we're gathered here today to start a journey. This journey is not your average everyday picnic, but a voyage of destruction. Forget that. These Southerners were once a part of our own country. Think of them as the swines that just shot your mother. Think of them as the men that raped your wife or your girlfriend. This mission will fail if you give any pity to the Confederacy. And so, with only the bare minimum of supplies, General Sherman and his troops set off on one of the greatest military rampages in history. Sherman's march to the sea would not come easy for the Union. General Joseph Johnston and General John Hood would give the Union a hard-fought battle every time the two armies met. <laughs> Them new Yankees think you're gonna burn Atlanta, ain't that right, Junior? Yup, you just said a mouthful there, Slim. Pass me that beach nut. I don't film any of it yet, so we saw. You can catch the sun fire, step back a little bit so you can get it on. Wait a minute, we can get everybody in there. Wait a minute. And so the battles rage. Oh! <laughs> oh! oh! My arms! <laughs> oh! My legs! Oh! 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 There was much bloodshed in the All right, tell us when to record. Here at the Elizabeth Blackwell Clinic, nurses tried vigorously to save the lives of many young soldiers. Although these hard-working women gave gallant efforts, thousands lost their lives due to lack of medicine and inadequate medical supplies. <clears throat> Hold on, let me get in the kitchen. Uh. Sir, you're going to live! You cut off my arms. It's the only thing we can do! But I ain't been shot. <laughs> get Steve. Yes! Yes, this surgery is a complete success! Dr. Herbert Frankenstein was a little-known part of the Civil War. <laughs> oh, yeah, yes! War is hell! Conditions in the prison camps were the worst in town. Weeks. <laughs> the Union forces led by Sherman reached Atlanta and conquered it and burned it to the ground. But that wasn't enough. They needed to reach Atlantic 
，嗯，累了，是，是，不是那书。What are you doing? <laughs> led by Sherman, reached the Atlantic. The Union forces, led by Sherman, reached Atlanta and conquered it, burned it to the ground. But that wasn't enough. They needed to reach the Atlantic and take Savannah. Men, I know you're tired and homesick, but we have almost got this war won. Do you really think so, General? Yep, and as soon as we win, you can all go home and see your families again. Yeah, we're all feelings in that man. The Union is right. We may have lost Atlanta, but we can't give up and lose Savannah. Yeah, Ralph, you ain't seen nothing yet. The Union is going down. Those Confederates will kick some butt next battle. Yeehaw! The battle at Savannah was rumored to be the battle to end all battles. Strange new weapons were first utilized in this, the last battle of the march to the sea. After the Battle of Savannah, the journey was almost over. You ready? Okay. Now I drop the tank. Well, men, we've made it together. Here we are at the Atlantic Ocean. Heroes, every one of us. We have devoured the land, and our animals eat up all the wheat and cornfields close. All the people return before us in desolation is behind. To realize what war is, one should follow our tracks. Hey man, this is Billy D. And after a few Colt 45s, I like to change into Lester and strut my stuff. Oh, that's better, man. Beer Billy D, that's cool with the chicks. But when you want to have some fun, you change to Lester and you cold get down and forget.